everyone, it's Kim. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. So today I thought I would quickly show you how I'm going to cook one of the dinners that I prepped during my five dinners, one hour prep session. So I have my Parmesan crusted mahi mahi here along with the veggies. And then if you can see behind me, I have some fries. I don't know about you, but when I have fish, I always want fries. So we're gonna throw some fries in the air fryer as we're going along. So I have my oven preheated to 400 degrees. I'm gonna grab my cooking spray, which I went to grab twice already and didn't do it. So I've got my cooking spray. So what we're gonna do is we're going to spray a sheet pan. And I just have this one here. There we go. And then I'm gonna start layering my ingredients right onto the sheet pan. one of those days. So now I have tongs so that I can throw the fish on the sheet pan. So we're going to open that up. We're just going to grab our fillets right out of here. Just want to be careful so that I don't mess with the topping. Now if you did not watch my meal prep video, um, I'll put that below so you can check that out. And again, this saves me so so much time, like just so much time when I get home from work. So you can see how quickly that went on. Um, here I have my broccoli and my carrots, and that just has some olive oil, salt, pepper, and some garlic in it. So we're going to pop that right on our sheet pan as well. Just gonna spread that around a little bit. Alright, and then I'm going to pop that into a 400 degree oven. I'm just throwing that stuff in my sink if you're wondering where I'm throwing it. I'm gonna pop this into a 400 degree oven. So I'm gonna pop that in real quick and then I will talk about the air fryer. So hold on. All right, so it says that we have to cook that for about 10 to 15 minutes. I'm gonna go 15 because I did not use the tilapia as they called for in the recipe. I did use mahi mahi. So Alexa, Set timer, 15 minutes. She never listens. Alexa, set timer, 15 minutes. 15 minutes, starting now. <laughs> Second time's the charm. All right, let me grab my basket out here. So I have my air fryer and today I'm using my Power Air Fryer XL. I get asked about this all the time. This is the 5.3 quart version. And this one I really like because of the fact that it's big. I can fit a couple different things in here. And if I want to make extra fries, I can do that as well. When I looked at the air fryers before I bought my first one, I, I was going to get the smaller one because, again, there's only two of us here. But the more research I did, everybody pointed me towards the bigger size. So it does make it easier to, like I said, throw things in there. Sometimes I'll use the divider and make two things at once. Sometimes I just toss everything in there. It's, just, it's not an exact science. I just, I just kind of experiment with it. So I'm gonna grab my fries and my kitchen scissors. And today I just have the crinkle cut fries here. Now, if you're wondering about my tilapia, my tilapia, which is in reality, mahi mahi, I should change that on my list. So my mahi mahi is five smart points and that includes the veggies. So five smart points, per fish filet. So that's really good. And I did make the extra one because I figured if we had extra, uh, we could either split it or I could throw it on a salad. So we'll decide what to do with that one later. So I'm just gonna open up my fries here and I'm gonna dump in about half the bag. And that does seem to be plenty just for the two of us. Now, the fries themselves, it is 18 fries or three ounces per serving, and that is four smart points. So it's a pretty good serving size, I think. So I'm going to set that aside, and I'm going to go ahead and start my air fryer. And I'm sure you can't see from way over there, but I'm just going to hit the button. I'm going to put this at 400 degrees. I'm going to back it down to 12 minutes, and I'm going to hit start. So as those are cooking, I am going to cut away 
and then when they're done I'll come back and show you the final product so we'll let those cook and if I have to adjust the cooking times again I'll explain that when we're done because like I said I'm the tilapia that it called for is a thinner fish and it would have taken less time to make and for the mahi mahi it is a little thicker so okay stay tuned and I will come back Doesn't that look delicious? It smells amazing. All right, we're gonna let it finish cooking. We have like five more minutes left, so we're gonna wait and see how much longer it takes, but I just wanted to kind of give you a really quick check-in. Look at those fish fillets. Mm. Okay, we're gonna pull these out. It's been about 18 minutes. We're gonna pull them out and check them. And I don't know about you, but I'm new to fish, so when I'm cooking fish, it's really hard for me to tell if it's done, but it says it should just flake. That looks pretty flaky. All right, I think that looks pretty good. Check the last one. All right, I'm gonna say that's done. All right, my fries are done. I'm gonna go ahead and plate this up and then I will show you a final picture of my plate when we're done. So, um, I'm not sure what else to say. Um, this is super easy. And now the only thing that I have to do is I have to wash out my air fryer and clean this pan and one bowl, and that's it. I mean, dinner cleanup is that easy. So everything will pretty much go into the dishwasher and then I'm done. So cleanup will just take a matter of minutes. And what did it take me? Five minutes to get dinner in the oven, so not bad. So when you get home, just go ahead and preheat your oven so it's ready to go. And then voila, dinner is done. So with that said, I'm going to sign off from here today. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this and I hope that you give something like this a try. Again, all the links of, I'm pretty sure my air fryer or anything else, I've, I'm pretty sure will be linked below and I will go ahead and link below the meal prep that I did as well. So with that said, signing off, have a great day. See you next time and thanks for watching. Bye.